I'm after buying this uh, 10 amp uh, 12 volt MPPT solar charge controller tidy little fella waterproof from uh, what's that Alto Solar um, and there she is small little thing um, it's uh, it can do uh, flooded lead acid AGM lithium gives the percentage charge and in the mode um, you get information like uh, battery voltage and uh, amperage coming in from the uh, solar panel. You can get this in uh, a few different uh, arrangements. I went for the one that has the uh, MC4 connectors and these quick connects. There they are there. Um, because it allows me to uh, use the MC4 connectors to connect to the solar panel and I can use these uh, uh, quick connect little terminals um, to go onto the battery and my intention then is to put an SAE on there and the uh, and the uh, crocodile clips but of course you have to watch with this SAE um, there would be reverse polarity if I went on so I needed to fit one of these reverse polarity connectors so that everything will be tickety-boo uh, come off there come off there and go straight crocodile clips and there's a 10 amp fuse on that uh, cable so that'll cover that straight onto the battery. I have a deep cycle battery. And on the other end then I will be going to the uh, MC4s for solar panel. Now it's very small. Is it MPPT? Don't know. Uh, that's a big question. Yeah, um, I saw on some blog that somebody mentioned that the coil is wound around the internal body of this to give the big coil. But I'm only going to have a 100 ampere hour um, suitcase solar panel, so the real difference between uh, PWM and MPPT in that situation, probably an amp or so. We'll see. I like it as much as it's waterproof, and you can just have it out by the uh, solar panel. But in this case it will be internal um, near to the battery. Instruction leaflet is, is quite good. But uh, yeah, it uh, goes through it all. And uh, you can either just use the uh, terminal blocks, quick connect, or you can use, there's enough to use MC4s either side. And then there's a little bit about uh, setting it up and uh, what all the uh, symbols mean for degree of charging specification yeah troubleshooting so yeah it's got everything and uh, there are a couple of options I went for this option with these connections I think it was about $43 I had to get it from uh, amazon.com USA so with uh, into Europe here with um, shipping and customs duty it turned out about 65 euros but you can you can get this unit with SAE connectors on it for slightly less than uh, the 43 dollars probably 40 dollars you can also get it with the SAE with reverse polarity cable just in case when you're connecting up to your solar or whatever that the SEs don't uh, match up positive positive negative negative that's around the same price as this $43 now the reason I got this is that I have um, a deep cycle battery which I'm using for my uh, Chinese diesel heater and at the moment I'm battery charging it from the mains but I also have an EcoFlow River Max which can be charged from solar as well. So I've gone for a Renogy suitcase type panel, 100 watts. I'm waiting for that to arrive. 
and uh, the intention is then that I can connect up I'll have a Y splitter arrangement I can connect up this to the battery and then um, when I don't need that I can disconnect it and put the uh, solar panel direct to uh, the uh, EcoFlow because it has its own inbuilt MPPT controller that's why I went with the Renogy without the solar charge controller but if you totted it up the difference between purchasing, purchasing the um, Renogy uh, with just bare cables and this and the Renogy with the controller I'd say they would equal out it's just that I didn't want the controller at the panel um, because of the uh, the River Max so that's why I went for this arrangement for this installation I got a few extra bits and pieces I got three meters of extension solar cable with the MC4 connectors to bring me from the solar panel into the into the building and um, this was a, a pack arrangement with two Y splitters various MC4 connectors and spanners um, but I also purchased these which are also uh, splitters these might be more suitable um, I might use these inside and uh, have these if I need to put uh, in the future some arrangement with two, two solar panels in parallel we'll see um, and this here is uh, a 10 amp inline um, MC4 fuse so I'll put that out at the uh, solar panel come in with the cables use either these or these to split and I have the various connectors to suit whatever way the cables are coming in whether they're male or female or whatever um, I wanted to get everything ahead of time all right there's a bit extra than needed but it's handy to have stuff in the old box because if you find you're short something you could be waiting um, the best would be a week or 10 days now we're up coming near Christmas but if it's out of China you can be four to six weeks so I'd rather have items and uh, it's amazing in the future you always find a use for this stuff so that's what I'm going to use um, with this little Alta Solar 10 amp MPPT controller. When, when I received the solar panel now and uh, have everything uh, rigged up, uh, I'll do a quick video on how it's all worked out. Good up for now.